This ape said Adam Marin within two years proves he cares about retail. He met you everywhere, even outside the country, to say thank you. He's a good CEO and they hate that. AMC was struggling. His job was to make sure it doesn't go bankrupt. He was protecting our money. Buy and hold Ape AMC GME. It's coming. They never thought we would hold for 2.5 years or maybe much longer. They thought that they could wait us out. They were wrong again. We will hold as long as it takes, never selling. Comment down below when you first got into this play and comment down below if you're going to hold until the end. This says if they were short AMC, then they were short Ape. Hundreds of millions, tens of billions, whatever. Ape dropped to 66 cents. They do not cover. Why not? Why pass up huge profits at such a low price? They can't locate the shares to close. Not then, not now, not ever. Checkmate. Now comment down below what you think about this. Is there actually a big issue with the short sellers being able to locate the shares? Or comment down below why you think they didn't cover at 66 cents per share. This ape says I don't pay attention to shills. Neither should you. Not worth my time. My time is valuable. It's not much job to babysit people and do research for them. I can't cure stupid and I can't waste my time trying to do so. If you can't see the potential in the AMC and Ape, then that's your problem. Very well said. AMC squeeze may be closer than I think. Who knows? Truly, no one knows for sure. All we know is you need certain ingredients for a squeeze enough short interest, which we definitely have. The recent short interest is back to all time high. A low float coming soon post reverse split and enough buying pressure from forced short closures. Retail FOMO and, and big whale FOMO could be coming very soon. This ape says, how's everyone feeling? I've been a holder for around three years now. I poured my savings into this and now I've been staring at around a 90% loss than what I put into it. I feel stuck at times because the dreams I had of buying a place for myself and my fiance aren't available anymore. I have to build my savings up and hope that this play pays off soon. Though there's no telling, is there? Sure, I can average on even more, yet it feels like if I do, then I'm delaying that dream even more. If it's been three years, what if it's another three years from here? I feel like I'm stupidly putting my life on pause. For six years for a Hail Mary. This isn't a shill post or anything. I still believe in the play. I'm just wanting to see if I'm alone or feeling of the dread, I guess. Now, of course, I want to hear what you guys think down below of this ape's thoughts and where they're at, but a few things from my opinion. This is, of course, a good time to talk about a very simple thing to know when investing in the stock market or any investment for that matter. Any investment that could go to zero, you should never invest more than you're willing to lose because, of course, there's always a chance it could go to zero. If you're looking to not risk any of your money, then it's better off in a savings account. But of course, for the apes that have some money on the side that they're willing to invest, and of course, see the potential of massive upside, then this play might be something worth looking into. 